Hockey News Live 10 at 10 continues with No Wait Weather. Now we start off with a live look outside the Valley News Live Storm Team Skycam Network shot in Fargo as we have clearing skies right now. And with the clearing skies and the lighter winds, temperatures are on their way down. We're down to 50 right now in Fargo. Some 40s on the map across Lakes Country, including Park Rapids at 43. Fergus Falls at 46, but Detroit Lake still at 52. So is Valley City and 50 out toward Jamestown. Lower 50s into the Devil's Lake Basement, already into the mid 40s into the Northern Valley. And and mid 40s to lower 50s across portions of northwestern Minnesota. Let's take a look at the wind speeds right now, flipping around to more of a westerly direction, but they have really uh, diminished over the last uh, few hours or so. Wind speeds across the region, 5 to 15 miles per hour. And we still have a few clouds, especially from Jamestown Valley City, Fargo points off to the south. Everybody else, especially into the northern valley, Devil's Lake Basin, and across our Minnesota counties, clearing out pretty nicely. High pressure is working its way in. We we had that system make its way through, gave us some showers, and uh, they're starting to clear out. And we got that uh, flow from the north or northwest. So we're going to be cool as we go through the overnight with that high cresting over us and light northwesterly winds. Now across the region, uh, going through the overnight, low temperatures tonight are going to be into the low to mid 40s, depending on where you look. And we actually could see some sunshine for your Thursday morning. But more clouds will approach from the west and from the south going through the afternoon. It will be breezier with a southerly wind. And there is a chance of some showers, especially later on into the day on your Thursday evening. High temperatures tomorrow near where they were today. We're into the mid 60s into the Fargo area with a few peaks of sun in the morning, mostly cloudy skies, maybe some rain showers into the afternoon and that wind will be a little breezy from the south 15 to 30 miles per hour. Up and down the valley into the low to mid 60s, some 50s on the map for tomorrow's highs into the Devil's Lake Basin and into northwestern Minnesota. Now as we go through the overnight on uh, your Thursday and your uh, into your Friday morning, we keep the chances some showers and then a decrease in cloud trend making our way through the day on Friday and uh, we will be clearing out just in time for Friday night plans. High temperatures on Friday a little cooler. Uh, we're going to be into the upper 50s and lower 60s for evening plans for your Friday evening into the mid to upper 40s, so a little chilly. And with the clear skies Friday night into Saturday, it looks like uh, we might have to deal with some frost with low temperatures across the region into the mid to upper 30s. Let's take a look at that photo of the day. It is called Autumn Equinox Sunset in Flom. Thank you to Bruce for this one using the back background of the seven day forecast. Now going through the weekend, first part of Saturday looks good, but a more steady rain will develop Saturday night lasting through Monday. High temperatures through the weekend into the upper 50s to near 60, trying to clear out on Tuesday, but another system makes its way through into Wednesday morning. Temperatures on their way down with highs in the low to mid 50s and low temperatures into the upper 30s to near 40. And that could possibly give us some snow showers in some areas on Wednesday morning. Oh, I don't want to hear that. I know. We don't want to think about it. Thanks, though. Yep. Anyway. Up next on Valley News Live at 10 at 10.